It's been two weeks since golf has returned to the Millennium Lakes Golf and Country Club. The club, like all other sport, had to shut down because of COVID-19. Video Ram and Rodney David visited the club to find out how well it's been coping. Ken Fuentes has the story. Millennium Lakes Administrator Lauren Lara said the first concern for administration was the well-being of the golfers and the business operations at the Trin City Golf Club. And measures were taken to ensure this was done. I think because it was such a worldwide pandemic, you know, we, we were privy to what should be done prior to even the government having to explain uh, what we need to put in place. So we quickly moved on having our sanitizing stations upgraded and basically changing what we knew prior to as the norm. And it was just basically everyone being able to get used to what we have to do going forward. She added the members were receptive to the changes during the shutdown as they accepted they were in their best interest. Because a lot of our members are over 60, uh, I think they, they agreed with what we had to do. It was not anything that one person could help and it was a better, it was a better choice for everyone. It was safer for everyone to do what we had to do. The course was maintained during the lockdown in the height of the dry season. And even that was done with strict social distancing principles. We did not have a full maintenance crew. We had very limited staff just to make sure the basics were done. And once we knew that we would reopen, we would get everyone back out. And one good thing is that we are in dry season, so the rate of the grass was not growing as fast as it would have during the rainy season. So we were able to control a lot more. We had a lot more control at that point in time. And how did the lockdown affect the course administrator? I think I tried to cook everything except doubles. <laughs> uh, but you know, we, I use it as a time to reflect. I think we, with COVID, it came at us at such a rate. We were all, we sh I was able to reflect on a lot of things and I came back with the intention of having a different frame of mind and moving forward and just planning ahead as to what we had to do to get the golf course back on track. While the course has been opened to golfers, the clubhouse remains closed. Kent Fuentes, TTT Sports.